Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how you can create this very voluminous ponytail with hair extensions because I posted this picture on Instagram and so many of you guys asked me to show you how I did it so that's what I'm doing today and if you're interested in the hair extensions I'm using in this video then it's Foxy Locks hair extensions and I do have a code down below I will also write it somewhere on the screen and if you use the code on foxylocks.com then you will save some money and also get a free gift with any purchase on the website. So without further ado, let's get into the video. The first thing you're going to do is to section off your hair from your ears and back and then clip that hair away with a hair clip. Then take a small section of hair in the middle and then secure that into a small ponytail. Now take a two clip weft and secure that around the small ponytail. When you have done that, then take another two clip weft and do the exact same thing with that one. To finish this part off, take two one clip wefts and then clip them around the ponytail as well. Now you're going to clip the remaining wefts into your hair. So I'm clipping a four clip weft into my hair right above the other extensions I just clipped in. Then I'm taking a smaller four clip weft and clipping that in above the other four clip one. Now I only have two three clip wefts left, so I'm adding one weft to each side of my head. Now you're going to tease the top part of your hair so you get a really big poof on the top of your head. If you want the ponytail to be really smooth, then remember to really brush over the hair after you have teased it. So if you want your bangs down, then section them off now. And if you don't, then just skip this step. It's been years since I had a change, always a watch out. Then I'm brushing all the hair into a ponytail and securing it with three elastics. And just use as many as you need so the pony stays in place all day. Then pull in the top part of your hair to loosen it up and give the pony a lot more volume. I pulled a lot in the back part to give the pony some height because I really like that look. Then I set my hair with some hairspray so the hair stays in place. Then I teased my bangs so they were a lot easier to style and also not so flat. To cover the elastics, take a small section of hair from under the pony and then wrap it around the elastics and then secure it with some bobby pins and a bunch of hairspray. Because I didn't curl my hair before adding in the extensions, I'm doing that now. But I would recommend curling your hair before adding in the extensions because that makes everything a lot easier. Then I curled my bangs and styled them before setting them with some hairspray. Oh, 
The last thing you need to do is to tease your ponytail to really fluff it up and make it really voluminous and then set it with some hairspray. So this is how I do my big voluminous fluffy ponytail and if you like this video then please give it a thumbs up and remember to subscribe to my channel and follow me on all my social media so we can talk. I will have all the links down below and then I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! I feel like I've inhaled a lot of hairspray.